Anytime, nice to see you. See you back in Australia. Uh, great to be back here. Hey Lewis, what gym would you like? I'd love something nice and dry and if it's made with payments that would be faster. Gin is exploding all over the world and we're starting to get used to the idea of seeing sort of regional styles. Do you see a style um, of gin coming out of Australia? If that's interesting. I'd probably say that Australian gin is a Western style gin, um, similar to the US. You know, we are making uh, London dry gin, but to me it's not quite the same as a, you know, as a London dry gin, you know, normally from the UK. So maybe at some point you might see you know, a definition of this side of the world of what type of gin it is, but right now I'd say sit in the western area. Please take a glass of those. I'll we'll pull you some of your your lovely London dry gin. So it's our local Australian rare dry gin from the Yarra Valley. Yeah, you know it well. Well, one of the uh, one of the early movers in the, uh, in the Australian gin movement. I'd say that's a pretty well made uh, gin here. Fresh botanical notes on here. Um, not as strong a presence on juniper as perhaps the classic London dry. This one already tastes smooth because you pick it up on the uh, on the nose, um, and I would expect the London Dry to be uh, crisper. Uh, nice spirit notes coming through on the Heyman side. Am I allowed to taste these? Go right ahead. Different, but again, it's that spicy botanical that's coming through uh, on this one. A nice little bit of spicy heat coming through on this to, to complement the juniper now. Nice, soft, gentle perfume on the nose. Botanical is holding up very, very well. And this one is sort of uh, a, a crisper, uh, nice spirit base, which we know is English wheat. Uh, but again, classic English uh, dry style uh, here. I would say bright juniper forward with the Haymans and uh, interesting. Um, mix of botanicals coming through here with a nice bit of spice in it. Uh, so real flavours, uh, if you like, profile delivery here uh, and a concentration on bright juniper and dryness here. 